How does a typical Turkish dinner look? Here is a great example of nothing fancy traditional Turkish menu with the main dish potato with meat, completed with rice and lentil soup and some side dishes like yogurt, pickles and bread. It has low budget everyday ingredients and is perfectly delicious. So let's make it. I begin with cooking my meat in pressure cooker. After sauteing I added hot water and continue to cook until it is soft. If you don't have pressure cooker just use a regular pan. It will only take a bit more time. For the pilav I am soaking 2 cups of long grain rice in hot salty water. After 20 minutes I begin to make my rice using about 2 tablespoons butter and 3-4 tablespoons olive oil and meanwhile my meat was already cooked and ready for the potato dish. I usually cook the meat more than I need and use the left for other times keeping in the freezer. You can make your rice plain but with the nutty flavor and the color I usually prefer to add some orzo pasta. The rice is soaked about 20-30 minutes. I washed it and drained while my daughter did here and going to saute them together for about 3-4 more minutes. There are many different methods cooking the rice but sauteing it always gives some nice more flavor so I prefer this. How do you make yours? I'm done with the rice, it's cooking, my onions are sautéed, adding some chopped green peppers from the freezer and one tablespoon each tomato and red pepper paste. These pastes are staple in Turkish cuisine. It is important to sauté them at least for 3-4 minutes before adding the other ingredients so you can get the taste better and after that I'm adding the cooked meat along with some stock Sometimes even a small help in the kitchen is very meaningful, especially when you are rushing. And thankfully I had my daughter to peel the potatoes. Just cut them into about 3-4 cm cubes.
to give some spiciness to the dish i'm adding this very hot red pepper dried it was too much so i added half of it filling with hot water until it covers and cook for about 10-15 minutes until potatoes are soft of course if you are not using pressure cooker make sure to check it will take more time Checking my potato dish, it looks very appealing and was perfectly cooked. Let me quickly give the lentil soup recipe with vegetables I make. You can use again regular or pressure cooker pan. Just heat some oil, add onions, carrots chopped garlic and potato it doesn't matter how you cut it we are gonna process everything add the spices you like I add dried mint paprika turmeric washed and drained red lentils if you have some chicken broth add it it gives more flavor and cook until soft process everything and your soup is ready as an option you can also heat some red pepper flakes in butter and make a nice delicious butter sauce on top these plates i'm using are traditionally used in diner like restaurants in turkey which we call lokanta they are small in size but when you fill it it looks full so you feel like you are eating a big plate full of dish even though it is not that much to give you a complete example i also added some yogurt pickles slices of bread and finish it with kadayıf dessert to see more turkish menus check my archive and don't forget to subscribe see you next time afiyet olsun